Hi fishy friends, this is Tiffany. I wanted to share a video that I actually filmed about six months ago with you. It shows the pair that's behind me when they were in a community aquarium and they were starting to pair up and show the male was showing some aggression and staking out some territory in the corner of the tank. I just thought you might find it interesting. I documented it kind of for my own information and just my, I was observing them and I found it to be interesting, their behavior and wanted to be able to look back on it, just depending on what happened and what didn't happen. And, um, but I, I got some things right in the video and I got some things wrong. They're definitely a pair. They've spawned a few times and they've had one successful spawn. However, they, um, I had them mixed up in the video. I was calling, uh, what I was, the one I was calling the females, actually the male. So the bright blue one with the zebra stripe is the male. And the dark one, the dark blue Pinoy, is actually the female. And I didn't know that for sure until I saw them spawning and saw her laying eggs. So the dark blue one is actually the female. And uh, so I did see them spawning and videoed that in January and actually filmed different segments of the babies kind of growing up to be, you know, several weeks old and found that, I just found it really cool to see their markings and see them develop. But I thought you might like to see this behavior and um, just thought I'd share this. Now, it's, what's interesting is even though this, um, this pair, the male was showing uh, a fair amount of aggression and chasing the other angelfish away from his territory, um, the other pair of angelfish that has come from that same tank and that same general age, they haven't spawned yet, but they did not show aggression really. And they, um, they just spent a lot of time together and were swimming near each other and kept just hanging around each other. So just kind of different, uh, behavior from these two different pairs, but I still thought that this might be interesting to see and I wanted to share it with you. So let me know if you have questions, if you have comments, I welcome those. I am very new to breeding angelfish. I have kept angelfish in community aquariums for over 20 years. And as I got bigger and bigger aquariums, I'd get more angelfish. And then I ended up getting, it just accidentally, kind of getting a pair or two, or actually three, several years ago. So I just thought I'd share this and I will appreciate you watching and I'll talk to you later. I've been observing these fish, and particularly this one right here. I've been trying to figure out if that's a male or female. There's been a lot of aggression, and um, mostly it's the fish that I believe are males that have been aggressive. But I'm beginning to think, I really believe that that fish is a female. They're all quite young, maybe approaching a year old. And I couldn't understand why, if that's a female, why she's being so aggressive. But I think she's getting ready to lay eggs. And this male, this black one right here with the long fins, that is her mate. That's the only angelfish that she does not chase. And you can kind of tell that she has chased all of the angelfish except him to the back of the tank. And earlier, they were cleaning a leaf on one of those plants. The plant that's right in front of him, right in front of the big black male. They were cleaning that leaf and I think they're getting ready to lay eggs. And tomorrow, I plan to put them in a separate tank by themselves. Upstairs, I need to switch some fish around but I need to clean out that tank first. So we'll see how it goes, but she, if that really is a female, she is a mean little thing lately. And, but that makes sense. That makes sense why she's just protecting where she's, see, they're cleaning that leaf. That's where she's planning to lay her eggs. That makes sense why she's being so mean to the other fish. Just learning to kind of stay away. I 
we'll see what happens. But yeah, we're gonna put her and her boyfriend in a separate tank by themselves. I think that'll be much more peaceful. That will work much better. I think I'm going to feed them some over by the tank. Not feeding you. Yep. Kind of hoping they don't lay eggs until I get them in their own tank. See, she's a mean thing. They're coming over here because they think I'm going to feed them, and she's chasing them to the back. I just wanted to document this behavior because if I'm right, they're about to spawn. If I'm correct in observing them this evening and see she's chasing that male. That's a big that's a big male with the veil fin. And that's why I couldn't figure out couldn't figure out I'm still trying to kind of verify and figure out who's a male and who's a female. They're so young it, it I could be wrong. But I'm, I think I'm starting to figure it out. We will see. Thank <laughs> you. 